The Duchess' older half-sister, Samantha Markle, previously tweeted from an account called at the Markle Sammy but a notice showed the account had been suspended on Monday. The notice didn't give any further details about the suspension, simply stating, account suspended. Twitter suspends accounts which violate the Twitter rules. Twitter later confirmed the reason, telling, we suspended the account due to ban evasion. The social media giant defines its ban evasion policy as being for people who try to sign up again for Twitter after their account has been suspended. The suspension comes after a recent BuzzFeed article alleged the account was used to post conspiracy theories about Meghan and her son Archie. However, the 57-year-old denied the claims and reportedly threatened to sue BuzzFeed News. Samantha's lawyer, Douglas A. Kale, said that her account appears to have been hacked. He told, Samantha's Twitter account appears to have been hacked, someone changed her password, and some of the Twitter screenshots that have appeared in the media very recently appear to have been altered or photoshopped. However, due to the urgency of this matter, we are still investigating. It comes after Samantha Markle claimed Prince Harry and Meghan made false and malicious statements about her in their notorious Oprah interview and Finding Freedom book written by Olmut Scoby. She has since launched a defamation case against her younger half-sister aiming to sue her for $75,000, £57,000, and demands that she pay her legal fees. She said the comments made by Meghan have caused her to lose employment and sales of her book, The Diary of Princess Pushy's Sister, which was released last year. Meghan's attorney Michael Kump said, This baseless and absurd lawsuit is just a continuation of a pattern of disturbing behavior. We will give it the minimum attention necessary, which is all it deserves. It comes after Meghan's dad, Thomas Markle, announced that he will be starting his own YouTube channel to discuss current affairs. In his debut episode, Mr. Markle pledged to support Samantha in the lawsuit, saying he would be thrilled to defend his oldest daughter and see Meghan and her ginger husband in the courtroom. Taking a swipe at his daughter, he said, I've been trying for almost four years to get to see my daughter and her ginger husband in a courtroom face to face. I'd be thrilled to defend my oldest daughter. At Convencia on Twitter commented on his actions, saying, no wonder she's distanced herself from him. Sometimes toxic relatives have to be cut out from your life. Another, at Ams Natasia, wrote, and still some were shocked she cut ties with her father and won't let him see his grandchildren. Samantha has been outspoken about her sister since the former Suits star went public about her relationship with Prince Harry in 2016. At the start of the couple's new relationship, Samantha spoke in an exclusive interview, which was titled, Princess Pushy Prince Harry's new flame Meghan Markle is a social climber who is not fit to be royal dash according to her own sister. Meghan Markle has been keeping a low profile recently and this is said to be because she has a lot on her plate right now to keep her busy at home. The last time the public saw Meghan was at the NAACP Awards when she and Prince Harry accepted the President's Award. Ahead of the star-studded ceremony, the couple had dinner with Princess Eugenie and her husband Jack Brooksbank at a local restaurant in Montecito, Santa Barbara, California. However, Meghan Markle was not at the Super Bowl to watch the game with Prince Harry and his cousin. This has led many to wonder what she has been doing in the time that she spent being away from the spotlight. A source even found it surprising that the Duchess of Sussex dined out with Princess Eugenie and Brooksbank as she has reportedly been staying out of sight for the longest time. Speaking of the get-together, the insider claimed that it was very clear Meghan and Harry didn't want to attract attention. They were reportedly ushered in very discreetly and picked a secluded table outside away from the crowd. Another insider acknowledged there have been all this buzz about what Meghan could be hiding and why she suddenly vanished. But she and Prince Harry are simply getting on with life and that she has plenty on her plate at home. Aside from working she also has her children Archie, two and Lilibet, nine months, to take care of. This is supposedly why she opted to stay home instead of watching the Super Bowl with Prince Harry and Princess Eugenie. It's very strange that she wasn't there. Meghan usually loves all that showbiz stuff, and the Los Angeles Rams are her home team. So everyone was confused by her absence, the source told. However. As much as people are criticizing Meghan for pulling a no-show, if you look at it from the other side, it was actually quite generous of her to let Eugenie go in her place. Prince Harry appreciated his wife's gesture that she gave up her seat so he could have some family bonding time with Princess Eugenie.